and girls, welcome back. Happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there. Malia and I had a very busy Mother's Day weekend. That's why we're doing our video on a Monday instead of Sunday. We were a little busy yesterday. We went for a hike. We had a little picnic in our backyard with our grandmas. Um, we had adorable matching outfits. It was an awesome Mother's Day weekend. Malia and Mr. McMillan made me breakfast in bed. It was awesome. This week we're going to read one of my favorite books of Malia's. It's a really silly book. It's lots of fun. And it's a kind of a cute message. It's called Feminist Baby by Lauren Brantz. Feminist Baby loves to dance. Feminist Baby says no to pants. Feminist Baby likes pink and blue, and sometimes she'll throw up on you. That is accurate. <laughs> Feminist Baby chooses what to wear. Thankfully, Malia doesn't argue with me yet about what to wear, so I can buy us matching outfits and wear them on Mother's Day, and she didn't even put up a fight. She even had a little photo shoot with me. And if you don't like it, she doesn't care. Feminist baby makes lots of noise. I bet Declan can relate to this one. Ramaya probably makes lots of noise. Feminist baby throws her toys. Feminist Baby plays with dolls and cars. And when she sings, she's a baby rock star. Feminist Baby is as smart as she seems. Feminist baby can be whatever she dreams. See, it's kind of a silly book, but it's also got a good message. It's telling you that no matter what, whether you're a girl or a boy, you can play with cars, you can play with dolls, you can like pink, you can like blue. It doesn't matter at all. You do what you want to do. You become what you want to become. If you're a boy and you want to be a nurse, Cool, do it. If you're a girl and you want to be a welder, awesome. You dream of what you want to do and you follow those dreams. I wonder what Malia will want to be when she grows up. Her daddy hopes she'll be a golfer. I don't know. I think she'll probably be a teacher like me. This week, Malia is, she's really focusing on things a lot more. I think her eyesight's getting better. So I'm noticing, like right now, she's, sees her spit cloth and she's staring at that. She's trying harder to stand up and hold her head up. She really likes when we lift her up. Her favorite thing to do right now is play airplane where we like lift her up above our head. She smiles. I think that's probably how we're going to get her to do her first laugh is by doing that because she loves it. She's noticing her toes. She can't quite figure out how to get them, but she's been looking at her toes a lot lately, so I'm sure in the next couple of weeks she'll find them, just like she did her hands. She likes grabbing onto things. She's got a strong grip too, which is fine for me because she grabs onto my fingers a lot. She really likes to grab onto Mr. Macmillan's beard, which is pretty funny. Maybe he'll shave it, I hope. Probably not though. Well, boys and girls, on Thursday, your moms and dads should have gotten an email from Miss T and Miss H saying that we're going to have a team's meeting and Malia and I are going to come 
So if you have any questions for Malia and I, make sure you write them down or get mom or dad to write them down. Come to the meeting on Thursday and you can ask us. We will be there. Hopefully Malia will be happy, not sleepy or hungry or grumpy, but with a baby, you never know. So I just wanted to say thank you very much for watching. I miss you guys all lots. I hope you're all doing well. And we will see you on Thursday.